Hi there, I'm Juliana Castillo from A Cup of Everything and in today's video blog I'm going to talk about television series. Okay, but what is a television series? Well, it's something that has been part of the entertainment industry of several countries in this world for decades. And I know that every one of you knows that already, but I feel the necessity to tell you and explain um, its meaning in more detail. So, television series are works of an audiovisual and generally narrative nature that are broadcast, obviously, on television, where each of them maintains plot continuity. So, if you think that you're not a person who likes television series because you think that they are boring, let me be the one who contradicts you. Because me, as a television series lover since my childhood, I know that there are a lot of different kinds of series with a lot of different plots that can interest you. For example, we have sitcoms like Friends, dramas like This Is Us, thrillers like Pretty Liars, and also medical dramas like Grey's Anatomy. So if you really need to give them an opportunity if you haven't, because you will love them. And I know it for sure. So for that reason, in this video blog, I'm going to I'm going to talk about for what reason people love series. Then I will share with you my favorite series of all time. And finally, I will tell you why streaming platforms can sell their series. Okay? Let's get started. For what reason people love TV series? Well, we need to we need to talk about the facts. Nowadays, human beings absorb information more quickly than in the past, and TV series are made in a format between 20 and 40 minutes, which makes them easier to watch, especially if we compare them uh, with movies that uh, whose duration on average is about one to two hours. But if you're looking for a more meaningful reason, we love TV series because with their story and their characters, they can move us or make us laugh. The format of the series has a great potential for emotional impact because simply it reminds us the way in which everyday life is presented. And obviously they can make us feel and live stories in different worlds that we wouldn't imagine before. Okay. Second, my favorite series of all time. Like I said before, I am a series, television series lover since I have memory. And I prefer, I really love and prefer watching TV series instead of movies at home or going to the cinema. Watching TV series now always reminds me of my childhood when my only concern was to do my homework and not miss my favorite Disney Channel and Nickelodeon shows in the afternoon. So, we have my favorite childhood series. And we can uh, see Wizards of Waverly Place, Sweet Life on Deck, iCarly, a classic, obviously, Victorious, Shake It Up, and Drake and Josh, just to say a few. But right now, my favorite series change a lot. And we can say that uh, here are Gilmore Girls, Bridgerton, The Green Pan Theory, Stranger Things, Heartstopper, and 2521. And I love them. I really love them for sure. So, if the series, the, uh, the television series are so good, why streaming platforms can sell their series? And I will tell you right now. But first, imagine this. 
you found a good TV series that you really loved, hoping that one day they'd confirm a second season. Months later, you see on social media that it was cancelled, without reason. Well, sounds like, a, sounds like a nightmare, right? But it's not. <laughs> it's a reality, and that happens every day. And it hurts a lot, believe me. But why are the, what are the main reasons? Obviously, numbers and money. It's really easy to guess, right? And, but why are these terms so important about the cancellation of a series? Well, let me tell you. <laughs> This is due to the enormous number of titles that are released each month that receive zero or no promotion from, from their streaming platforms. And that is so awful. And if you think about it, this is like a, a snowball effect. Since we as consumers of this series rarely watch them or even know about their existence. And this is so sad because there are a lot of series that had a lot of potential, but we didn't know about them. This is the worst combination ever. No promotion plus no audience plus no numbers equals cancellation. It is what it is and we can change that. So, unfortunately, obviously, I have my favorite shows that were canceled. And I, the only I can remember right now are Julie and the Phantoms, <laughs> Everything Sucks, and The Society. And I will never forget you, Netflix, <laughs> for do that. And I hope that you know that. So, for summary... We can say that TV series are an essential part of everyone's lives. Also mine. We can find TV series with many interesting plots that we can love. We only need to give them an opportunity to amaze us. They also have the power to make us remember the good old days, which is awesome. We need to appreciate TV shows because, believe it or not, They are a way to express art too. So, thank you for listening, and we'll see each other on other video on my blog. Bye.